Hey, what's up you guys? I'm back for another video today. The Indianapolis Colts, yes, the team that I represent, I have been representing for many, many years. We defeated the undefeated Denver Broncos tonight in Indianapolis, 39-33. to Paid him in the pass for 386 yards, three touchdown passes, and one interception. Andrew Luck was a beast tonight. He passed for 228 yards, three touchdown passes, no fumbles, and no thrown interceptions. See, Andrew Luck, he hasn't passed for that many 300 yards. Three, he hasn't had that many 300 yard passing games like he had last season as a rookie. But it don't matter. We are winning games. We are 5 and 2. The Denver Broncos are now 6 and 1. The last remaining team to be undefeated this NFL regular season is the Kansas City Chiefs, who are standing alone at 7 and 0 after defeating our divisional rivals, the Houston Texans, today 17 to 16 in Kansas City. I'm glad they picked up that win and I'm glad the 49ers beat the Titans today. So that was a huge win for them to help us out and get our division lead even bigger. We have a bad week coming up after this game tonight. We have a bad week. Then after that bad week we have the Houston Texans who I just mentioned. We need to win that game. They're 2-5. and five. They are struggling heavy. We need to win that game most definitely and get our division lead to increase and not decrease. The Denver Broncos are 6-1, second in the division to the Kansas City Chiefs, who are number one, like I said. Hey, man, and thank you for everything that you have done for this organization and for my team that I represent. You are the greatest quarterback in my eyes in NFL history. A lot of people have different opinions, but in my eyes, you are the greatest quarterback ever. And some people will say that you are the greatest quarterback in regular season history, and I have to agree with that. Skip Bayless is the main one that has been pointing that out since day one. The Detroit Lions lose to the Cincinnati Bengals today in overtime 27-24. Megatron, Calvin Johnson, and A.J. Green were battling today. They both had 155 yards receiving, but in the end, A.J. Green and his, AJ Green and his team picked up the victory, a much-needed victory to be 5-2 and two and stand alone as number one in the AFC North Division. Last but not least, the game I said, the Titans and the 49ers. I watched that game, and I'm glad the 49ers got that game, and they got that victory for us. That's all I want to say about that game. You know, it really wasn't that much big of a deal because it was pretty much an easy win until the fourth quarter when the Titans, you know, they were trying to come back, trying to get a little something, something done, but it wasn't enough. This is your boy DJ Charlie. I'm out of here. See you guys in my next video. Like this video, share it on Facebook and Twitter. Also, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. Peace out. Until next time, I will not have a video for tomorrow night's Minnesota Vikings and New York Giants game, which will be in New York. I will not make a video for that game. It's probably going to be boring as hell. And I do not want to make a video for that game because I just want to rest and take a week off. And I will be back next Sunday for the Vikings and the Packers on Sunday Night Football. Also, Peyton Manning, thanks for that Super Bowl. We really appreciate that. Peace.